PEGI 18 Welcome to Call of Duty Insider, a series of tips and tricks videos to give you an edge on the competition. XP is the currency of champions. You need it to unlock guns, attachments, and perks. In this episode, we're going to discuss earning more XP. Following orders. First and foremost, make sure you always pick up your daily and weekly orders from Major Howard and Headquarters. These will give you tasks like win one hardpoint match or get 15 LMG kills. Completing orders can reward you with time 25% XP boosts along with Major Howard's admiration. Look at that handsome son of a gun. Completing orders can get you supply drops too, which also have a chance of popping out these sweet, sweet XP boosts. Epic. You can hold three daily orders and three weekly orders at a time, so make sure you've always got some in your inventory to work towards. You can also get a chunk of XP for completing contracts that you purchase from the Quartermaster, but beware, contracts have a limited time. Up to the challenge. You'll also receive XP from completing challenges. These can be viewed by selecting the dossier from the Soldier tab in the multiplayer menu. Practically anything cool that you do in MP can get you progress toward these challenges. Earning Merciless Medals. Getting Headshots. Getting Melee Kills. You name it. You'll get a nice chunk of XP for each tier that you complete. Plus, completing all of the challenges in one of these categories will reward you with a sweet animated mastery calling card. Look at that little guy go. He seems fun. Objective Directive. While getting kills in Team Deathmatch can certainly score you a nice pot of XP, there's even more XP to be had for helping to complete objectives in the objective-based modes. You'll get bonus XP for the obvious stuff, like capturing a point in Domination. But you'll also get bonus XP just for defending a point or killing a defender. But ultimately, War Mode is probably the best bang for your buck when it comes to earning XP. The games are longer, but if you play the objectives, you can easily net out with over 25,000 XP. And if you stroll into a match with one of those nifty XP boosts active, you'll be getting promotions faster than my boss's nephew. No one believes your management material, Myron! And that's it for this episode of Call of Duty Insider. Follow these tips and you'll be kicking back in the prestige overlook in no time. Be sure to check back often for more hints, tricks, and everything else Call of Duty World War II.